Every nine minutes, someone in Canada will have a stroke. It's a leading cause of disability for Canadians. March of Dimes Canada has developed the After Stroke program to support stroke survivors as they travel the road to recovery. One such program is the Stroke Survivor Groups. We heard about a program that was being established at West Park. It would bring together stroke survivors to meet and share their experiences. Often there's a guest speaker giving a talk about any number of items. Since his stroke, Sean Russell has been a regular attendee of the group along with his wife, Catherine. I think one of the hard things about stroke is that you're just isolated going from your home to your doctor's appointment and back again. And uh, there's a, an opportunity there for depression to start in and despair. And I think the Stroke Survivors Group was very beneficial in uh, keeping the involvement in the community. It provides an opportunity to let folks know that uh, you're not alone and to realize that uh, some of the things that I was feeling or experiencing were not unique to myself and to be aware of those experiences and how to deal with them has been very useful. Sean's involvement with the After Stroke program has greatly helped his recovery and has allowed him to renew his lifelong passion for rock climbing. After the stroke, it's taken a lot of time to recover, to be able to climb again. But with lots of hard work and encouragement, I've made it back to being able to climb at a fairly high level, and uh, that's encouraging. I mean, how many people 62 years old can say they're improving? I mean, it's, it's wonderful. I think it's my class above my head. Conductive education has been a mainstay in the After Stroke program, and 20 years ago, it was a major contributor to Patricia Bonnell's recovery. My favorite part of conductive education program is working with everybody else in the class. You're not just alone, like you do physiotherapy, you're doing it by yourself with one physiotherapist. This you're working with other people in the class, and it encourages you and stimulates you to become more active. Patricia has just recently rejoined the program to gain further benefits from it. If you keep working at it, you will get better, you know. You just can't give up, that's the thing. And to my mind, you don't give up. Right shoulder up. The directors of the program are very nice and very easy to work with, and they're very supportive. And that's important in stroke, to be very supportive. Laura Kaufman suffered a stroke in a ski accident nine years ago. Part of her recovery has involved a weekly spin class to be able to go there every week and spin with my friends and be just Lara, not Lara the stroke survivor, but just Lara, makes me feel like I'm normal. It is this positive attitude that has made Lara a great volunteer in the After Stroke Hospital Visitation Program. Hi, my name is Lara, I'm a volunteer here. I walk into a room and I'm providing hope and letting them know what the road looks like, what to expect from their journey, and that there is life after stroke. And that's the most important thing because when you're in the hospital, you don't know what life is going to look like. There are a lot of unknowns and, and that's where fear grows. And it's people like Lara who can um, help reduce some of those fears. If I can help one person, I feel good about myself. So I get as much benefit out of it as they do. Well, you're not afraid of that situation? Just, get, just getting in. So there are two things that I will tell patients. One is that if you do nothing, nothing will happen. And that stroke recovery is like climbing a mountain. It takes hard work, perseverance, and patience, but the view from the top is spectacular. Over the years, thousands of Canadians have benefited from the After Stroke program. Donations to the March of Dimes Canada means giving people hope so they can get their lives back. It's a program that is having an impact on people's lives. It's great work, important work, and I hope it carries on. Your support is greatly appreciated. <laughs>